I shall deliver a lecture on Yogasanas today. Health is wealth. Health is indeed a covetable possession. Good health is a valuable asset for one and all. It can be achieved with the regular practice of Yogasanas. The practice of asanas controls the emotions, produces mental peace, distributes prana evenly throughout the body and different systems, helps in maintaining healthy functioning of the internal organs, gives internal massage to the various abdominal organs. Physical exercises draw the prana energy out, but the asanas send the prana in. The practice of asanas cures many diseases and awakens kundalini shakti. These are the chief advantages the yogic system of exercises which no other systems have. Practice a few asanas daily at least for a period of 15 minutes. You will possess wonderful health. Be regular in your practice. Regularity is of paramount importance. Practice bhujang salab dhanur, sarvang hal, and Paschimutasanas, Bhujang, Salab and Dhanur Asans will remove constipation and muscular pain of the back. Sirsh, Sarvang and Hal will help you in maintaining Brahmacharya, rendering the spine elastic and curing all diseases. Paschimutasana will reduce fat in the body belly and help digestion. Relax all muscles in Sevasana in the end. Asana should be done on empty stomach in the morning or at least three hours after food. Morning time is best for doing asanas. Do not wear spectacles when you do asanas. Wear a singlet if necessary and a lung coat. Be moderate in your diet. Practice of brahmacharya is very important in success for success in yoga asanas. Start with minimum time for each asana and then gradually increase the period. Answer the calls of nature before you start the practice. Boys and girls over 10 years of age as well as women can practice asanas. The world needs good healthy strong boys and girls. What do we find in these days in India? India, the land of rishis and sages, the land which produced Bhishma, Bhima, Arjuna, Drona, Ashwatthama, Kripa and Parshurama, and countless other chivalrous variants, the soil which contained numberless Rajput chiefs, of undaunted courage and bachelor strength, now abounds in weak and timid persons. Children beget children, the laws of health are ignored and neglected, the nation is suffering and dying. The world requires numberless brave moral adhyatmic soldiers who are equipped with the five virtues, namely Ahimsa, Satyam, Asteya, Brahmacharya and Aparigraha. Oh.